sights and smells that signal Christmas is on its way. But even the councils are counting their pennies and hoping that the retailers are going to recover from the lockdown restrictions that kept revenue down. Over the next couple of weekends, Christmas tree lights will be lit across the UK. Here in Belfast, it was a very low-key ceremony in order to keep costs down. The 18th annual Christmas market is now well underway. It brings millions into the local economy, as it's one of only two on the island of Ireland. Traders here are hoping that the cost of living doesn't bite just so tight. Oh, we love Belfast. It's amazing. <laughs> um, we, it's the first time we've been here. We've never been to Belfast before. We've never traded here. The people are super friendly and the city is super clean. Cheryl Rudman is a South African who is hoping that her culinary delights may catch on in the Belfast market. Of course, the cost of living is getting so expensive. People sometimes feel that they will might splash out a little bit more on smaller things, you know, and just give themselves a bit of joy by walking around, having something different to eat, eating out, you know, every third night or fourth night and popping down to the market, you know, to see what it's about. Um, we have something here called uh, uh, bunny chow, which is literally a loaf of bread, half a loaf, which scoop out the middle, the inside, and then we stuff it full of curry. Um, that's in, in South Africa, there's a province, um, Durban, and that's mainly a Durban dish type of uh, style. Abdul Shafferness has traded here for many years and says that they are keeping prices down and people are still buying. Honestly, it's not affecting people. We're trying ourselves as well to be not to put the prices up, even though this is handcrafted. But we're taking uh, into consideration what's going on. We have to help each other. The market is an attraction that brings footfall into Belfast, and the city will be anxious to keep shoppers there. But the rising energy costs have seen downscaling of lights throughout the area, and retailers are hopeful that the Christmas feeling doesn't dim. Doogie Beattie, GB News, Belfast.